all right hello hello welcome to heal and ascend to row so i hope everyone is doing well today is going to be your pick a card reading so we're going to take a look and see the person on your mind what are they feeling about you at this point in time keep in mind you can choose multiple piles for different people um, i also have personalized readings if you want something that is more tailored to your situation uh, and there is twenty dollars off with the promotion that is going on it is wow 20 exclamation point i'll leave it down below okay but let's jump in and see so i'm just going to move these over for now okay so if you guys chose crystal number one let's take a look and see this looks like oatmeal <laughs> let's take a look and see how does this person feel about you right now oh they're in regret oh okay this could be why we have the card of deceit the hanged man the nine of pentacles the high priestess and we have oh wow so we have the high priestess and we have i send you telepathic messages okay can you guys see all of these cards okay that light is making a huge glare i'm realizing sorry about that um <clears throat> okay wow so pile number one how this person is feeling about you it's like they've had some time to observe their behavior. If you're on a pause with this person, they have been seeing the error of their ways, okay? I do feel that um, this person feels like you're someone who is very independent. They're seeing that you don't really need them. Like, you, maybe at one point they felt that you needed them to be happy or you needed them in, in your life and now that they're seeing that you guys are not together and like you're still doing your thing you're taking care of yourself you're good you're independent you're living your life they're realizing that you never needed them in the first place like you didn't need them and this is what they're this is why they're it's like they're seeing something different about the situation they're realizing the error of their ways they're really feeling regret for this deceit so they did deceive you. This card is so evil looking though. I don't know. It's just, uh, like I sometimes see the seven of swords or the five of swords as to see it. But for some reason, like I haven't used this deck in a while, but this deceit card, like specifically the imagery, I feel like this person did something really shady. Like this is someone who, they might've went to great lengths to deceive you okay this is also someone who's very spiritual or someone who is very intuitive at least um if you are feeling like this person is communicating you communicating with you in the 5d or through your dreams it's because they are but i feel like they're deliberately doing it so some people they don't realize they are it's just kind of like their higher self um or their connection to the metaphysical that is kind of sending off their thoughts but i feel like this is someone who deliberately like sits down and tries to channel your energy and tries to connect with you um they may also get tarot readings i feel like they're into spirituality they're into intuition um this is kind of a weird side message for some of you this person may be like a gamer that may also just help to kind of solidify that this is your reading i'm seeing that someone could be a big gamer this could be you or them I feel like this person is holding on to something that represents this connection. It could be something tangible or it could be like a message or a photo, but they're holding on to something that is a memory of you. Um, because I feel like this person in this pause right now doesn't really know what to do. Now the thing is, I'm not necessarily saying that this is someone who's going to change because I feel like they've been deceitful. And they are regretful, but I'm not necessarily seeing someone who's changing at this point in time. But again, we're just taking a look at what they're feeling for you in this moment. But they feel like you don't really need them. Again, I think maybe they did think that. Maybe they felt like they could manipulate you because they felt like you needed them. But they now, they now know that you don't need them. Um, you're very independent, okay? Like, they're seeing you in a different way. And I feel like this person is struggling to be straight up with you. So that's why they're communicating with you a lot telepathically. So if you find that you get so many telepathic messages from them, this is why. 
okay so i hope that resonated for you guys if you want to book something personal i do have 20 dollars off readings the link is down below let's move on to the fool's gold okay so if you guys chose this crystal here how does this person feel <clears throat> okay right off the bat did you guys hear that my throat just closed so let's see what comes through but we have curious The Thinking Woman, Five of Cups, the Ace of Swords, the Justice card, could be a Libra, and we have My Life Has Changed So Much Since Meeting You. I don't know why I'm not spreading these out enough. <clears throat> okay, you guys can see all of them. Pile number two. So what's up with all this regret? Pile one had regret. Five of cups is my card of like disappointment, regret. Pile two, they're feeling like they want to fix things with you. They've been thinking about you nonstop. It's like you don't leave this person's mind. Um, I feel like their thoughts spin in regards to you. It's like their mind is constantly spinning, thinking about you. Um, you've really piqued this person's interest. Now, I don't, like, I feel like you're a challenge to this person. I don't know if this is new, old, if you're together, I'm not sure. But I feel like you, you're like a challenge to this person mentally, okay? It could be that they're very intelligent. And it, it's not often that they find someone who's also, like, intellectually stimulating. I feel like this is someone who is, um very intrigued by you okay very intrigued by you it's like you're very intelligent even with this thinking woman i feel like this is them but i also feel like this is you you're very smart why does it keep telling me that you challenge them mentally you challenge this person mentally but why does it seem here that this is someone who may have messed things up a little bit with you because with the justice card here they're feeling like they need to make things right now it may just be something minor but they want to fix something with you they want to clear the air on something um they're saying here my life has changed so much since meeting you and the reason why this is i'm feeling here is because they haven't met someone like you before you could be someone who has really piqued their interest in multiple ways like you could be physically attractive but it's like your mind it's your mind that they're really drawn to um this may be someone who meets a lot of like attractive women or men but it's like it, they never feel that strong connection because there's not like that intellectual kind of um vibe okay for lack of a better word so i'm seeing here that they are disappointed by something that they've done they may also feel like you're going through something like they may worry that you're not over a past partner or you're not over something that happened here they feel for some reason they feel like you're not fully present with them like there's something that may be taking your attention away and it could just be that you're intelligent it could just be that you've got other things on your mind that maybe are more important than this person i feel here but they feel a sense of like sometimes you um come across as a little bit distracted or like you've got other things that maybe are more important than them i feel i think this is also why they're very interested in you it's like you just you're focused on other things um you you give them attention when you want to give them attention but they like this about you this person's very interested in you very very interested not only that it's like i feel like they haven't met someone like you okay so that's how they're feeling pal too you're coming across as kind of mysterious so i hope that resonated if you want to book something personal i do have 20 dollars off with the promo down below let's take a look at the black tourmaline how does this person on your mind feel about you disappointed we've got the sacral chakra the five of wands the two of swords the queen of cups and i'm taking responsibility for my mistakes okay you got this person in their feels okay 
Um, right off the bat, I feel like this could be a Scorpio. It could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, but I'm getting strong Scorpio energy, or you could be. Um, this person is very uh, emotional and fiery. They could have a lot of um, water and fire in their charts. I feel like this is someone who is very passionate about things, but also very emotional, okay? Like, they go all in. This feels like an all or nothing type of person. Um, how they're feeling about you right now. There's some sort of disappointment. There's something that... They feel like you're slipping away somehow here, pile three. They feel like they've lost a grip on this situation, okay? Like at one point they felt like they had this and then they lost it with you. Um, this person might have been intimidated by your options. They might have let their insecurities, I just looked up and it was 11-11, this person might have let their insecurities um, get the best of them when it comes to you and this connection. I feel like they see you as someone who has a lot of suitors or a lot of people who want your attention, like a lot. So, like, I don't know, I don't know how this is going to play out for you guys, but from their perspective, they feel like you have a ton of suitors, like a ton of people who are just fighting for your attention. And because they are so passionate, right? Like this is someone who is like when they are in, they're just all in, like they go full force because not only do they have the passion, they also have this like emotional pull. This makes them really jealous. I feel like this person became extremely jealous. They might've done something that they're regretting i think all the piles had regret the reason why i say that is because we have i'm taking responsibility for my mistakes so they did something that might have caused you to pull away from them a little bit here and they're feeling that like they're almost feeling disappointed that um they let go of this somehow or they lost touch with you in some regard um, I feel like they're disappointed in themselves, it feels like. I feel like they're disappointed in themselves. And that's why they're taking responsibility for what they've done here. Now, they don't know what to do about this, though. Like, with the Two of Swords, I feel like they're avoiding... They're trying to avoid thinking about you. They're trying to avoid having to m make any decision about you. It's almost like they don't even want to have you in their mind because it's so... It's causing them so much emotional turmoil like their heart is just wide open i feel like this is someone who maybe doesn't even know how to close their heart it's like they feel things deeply even if this is a man it doesn't matter this is a man who's very in touch with their feminine side and i feel like they just feel things on a very 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 deep level and because of this it's like sometimes they have to avoid it in order to function in their everyday life so they're trying to make up their mind about what to do I feel like the other thing is that they're trying to, because they feel like you have so many suitors, some of them may know these people. Like, some of them may know the other people who are interested in you, and that's what, F, like, I was going to say Fs them up. That, literally, that's what I, that is what I want to say. It, like, it messes up their head. It messes up their head because they're just constantly thinking about the competition. They're constantly thinking about, wait a second who's that girl or who's that guy or where did he come from or what does he do like they're constantly fixated on all of this competition or these people around you who want you that they're like missing out on just being with you and I think that's what messed them up I think they were too distracted by everyone else that wanted you that they weren't just focusing on you okay so that's how they're feeling, guys. I hope this resonated. If you want to book something personal, my information is down below. And I am offering $20 off readings with a code WOW20! Exclamation point. All right, but I'm sending you absolute love and light. And I wish you all the best on your journeys. Take care.